Welcome to Clones TV. Thank y'all for tuning in. Tonight, we got another banger. I'm your boy, T1. And I'm your boy, T2. What's the damn deal, man? What's going on, man? I see you over there looking all fly shit. What's going on with you? Man, just feeling good, man, on that Ciroc. You know what I'm saying? Just feeling myself right now, man. All right? Well, let's go and get started. Yeah. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now. Do yourself a favor and go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Ain't nobody on YouTube putting it down the way we putting it down. Unboxing and review on these shoes. Drink. Have a good time. That's how we do on Clones TV. If you have subscribed already, appreciate it. Thank, Thank you, man. You know what I'm saying? Appreciate the show it. going in the right direction, and it's because of y'all. So, uh, if you comment, we do respond back. Best believe we do. Uh, we show love. Y'all show us love. We appreciate it. And share. We got to get this out. You know what I'm saying? Show going in the right direction. Let's get started. You ready? I'm ready. Let's go. All right. Uh, Yeezy Boost. 350 V2 blue tint. Your boy didn't hit on them. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. The shoe, I'm not too crazy about the shoe, but when it come to Yeezy 350s, I try my best to get them, to put a raffle in, even if I'm not crazy about the shoe. But when it come to Yeezys, you know, they hard to get. The 350s I'm talking about. It's hard to get. I just can't believe I ain't hit on them because I put a lot of raffles in for them. My account, my wife account, and I didn't hit. Again, I'm not too crazy about this particular shoe. The shoe look like the zebras. I have the zebras. It's not a bad looking shoe. According to Stack X, uh, my size, size 12 is going for three. 37 so the resale value up there you know what i'm saying and uh i'm not tripping your boy didn't get them if you got them let me know drop a comment i will respond but uh the shoes are right. it's a easy 350 you know what i'm saying so wouldn't mind having those in the collection don't don't have them it is what it is let's move on now if you've been following this channel three weeks ago uh, I did a, a review on the Atmosphere, Air Jordan 6 Atmosphere, grade school size. Got them for my daughter. And uh, I say that to say uh, they're coming out real soon on Nike sneaker app on the 4th of this month. Air Jordan 6 low Chinese New Year. Uh, man, the shoe don't look that bad. Ivory colored leather upper, metallic gold accents. Um, I'm gonna try to get them. Not crazy about them. Don't gotta have them. But Clones TV, uh, that's what we do on this on this channel. We try to get these shoes. Your boy don't have no plug, so the shoe the shoe is dope. The shoe is dope. I'm not a low top guy when it come to J's, but. Um, I will make an ex exception because uh, on this show we do unboxing and review. So not only I'm doing it for me, I'm doing it for y'all. If you're going to get the shoe, if you're going to try to get the shoe, if you feel in the shoe, if you think the shoe hot, if you think the shoe trash, go ahead and come in on it. Your boy, we'll hit you back. But uh, we're going to try to get the shoe. You know, they a'ight. Right. They a'ight. Right. All right. <laughs> all right, T2, it's all on you. Take it away. All right. Now, before we get to the unboxing, I wanna go here first. Which is better? The Air Jordan 6 Retro Black Infrared or the Jordan 6 Retro Electric Green? Which is better? 
You tell me which is better. Which is better. Which is better. Now, I know a lot of y'all gonna say these, the breads, black and red or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, anything black and red is hot. Resale value, the value on them is high. But uh, let's talk a little bit about these. Now, they came out on the 19th, uh, 216.19. Retail price, $200. Resale value on stock X as of today, uh, 23rd, $460. Size 12, my size. Goat, $459, size 12. These are more valuable. We all know that. We all know that. Just a little info on the infrared. Now, electric green. Uh, they came out six five twenty one. Stock X resale value two hundred and fifty dollars size twelve. My size goat two seventy five size twelve. Now, I like both of them, but my favorite color. Black, red, and white. We're gonna go with these. These are hot. Y'all tell me what's y'all favorite? Which one you like the best? I know majority of y'all gonna say these. I know majority of y'all gonna say these. These are dope. But I wanna know who gonna say these. How many people gonna say these? Electric Green Fire. Fire. I mean, they fire. I'm rocking with these. I'm rocking with these. Black infrareds. All right. About three weeks ago, I told Goat to kiss my ass. First of all, I want to say, Goat, y'all can kiss my ass. I did a video on uh, Cool Gray Lovins. I ordered from Goat because I didn't hit on the raffle. I didn't get them. And uh, I think they sent me some fakes. So I sent the shoe back, they gave me go credit, and I reordered them again. They're coming from Hong Kong. That's what it says. So I'm like, man, I'm about to go through the same shit again. So right here it was a Chinese sticker. It's not on this box. So we good with that. You open the box. And right here, as you can see, it have a Nike tag in Chinese letters. See that? But it's a Nike tag, so we, we cool. So before I get to the shoe, let's look at the box. The box, you don't have the quality control sticker. Got the green sticker, but you don't have the quality control sticker, so we good. The box is good. Moving right along. All right. The shoe, shoe look dope. Shoe look nice. Look at that. Icy. I think it's the real deal. Look at that. Hold it up for y'all. All right. Let's take the insole out. First, shoe tree. Shoe tree look the same. Mold it. Yep. Sock liner. Shoe tree good. But look at that. Insole. Don't got the box like the last last shoe I had. And it don't have the blue stamp. So these legit to me, y'all. These legit. Only thing I see different than my partner's shoes. The ones that, you know, my partners that hit on the raffle, it don't have the size sticker. But I'm I, I'm a, I'm gonna just say these the real deal, man. Compared to the shoes I got from Goat last time, you know, uh, I don't have the red flags. I do not have those red flags. And the last shoe looked dope. It just I just couldn't rock with them. But I'm gonna say these these legit, man. And then the widow peak is real small. It ain't thick like the other one. The other one was real thick. These are legit. They legit. Rockin' with them. Thank you, goat. Y'all got it right. <laughs>
apologize for saying kiss my ass too. <laughs> but these legit. Alright. Well look, there you have it. If you haven't, go ahead and subscribe. Oh man. I'm feeling good. I'm on that alcohol. Oh man. <laughs> you on it. Uh if you have subscribed, appreciate it. That's your shoot review and unboxing for the week. Yeah. It's been fun. Your boy about to go lay down. <laughs> and uh man. It's, it's it's been it's been a good show. It's been a good yeah, show. Yeah, yeah. I'm your boy T1. I'm your boy T2. Thank y'all for tuning in. This Clones TV. The show where we do unboxing and review and drink that Ciroc once a week. Once a week. We out. Peace. Peace, <laughs> baby. <laughs> Fucked up ass.